hockey people are different. They're different. They definitely have a different attitude about a lot of stuff. Uh, they're tough, for one. You know, we're not the type of family that you get to lay around and complain about your ills or your injuries or stuff like that. You know, you basically get up and you get you play on. Uh, my oldest son, Victor, is uh, he'll be 16 in October, and he started playing when he was four years old. And you know, at that time, I was playing for. I started playing the year that Victor was born in the adult leagues. I knew a lot about hockey from watching hockey and then started to get more and more education about it. And I said, well, I'll coach him when he's a mite. And that's what they are, a mini mite. And then uh, I coached him then. And then you kind of keep waiting for the next guy that's going to coach to come up and step up. But there weren't guys. You know, you know a lot of kid, a lot of dads don't skate. They don't know play hockey. So each year we continue to stick with it and stick with it. So and then you end up. I guess now it's 12 years of it, me the coach in Vicar Ali. So and it's a big thing is just being there and enjoying the experience with them as well. I'm Army medic or a retired Army medic now. So a um, uh, couple combat tours, 22 years active duty. Uh, and then also my my real profession is I'm a, a nurse by trade. So I've had uh, been involved in medicine since uh, late, late 80s. Uh, this deployment, I deployed as a company first sergeant, took a company over there and uh, responsible for soldiers, uh, five geographical areas across Afghanistan. So a lot of travel, checking out my guys. I really wanted to push the kids to leadership and, you know, you know, taking responsibility because, you know, I kind of see it the same way. A team's, military's a team, hockey's a team, and uh, that's really how I feel about it. So. As a child, we grew up skating. We had a pond in our on our property and we grew up skating. We never played hockey, but we skated all the time. And then when I was 30, my sister said, you have to come try this. She was playing goalie for a women's league in town. And so I went out one day and tried it, borrowed some equipment and played for an hour and was immediately addicted because I was nobody's mother or wife or nurse. It was just me trying to get to that puck. And that's all I could think of for the entire hour was how can I get there quicker in front of somebody else? And it, I was sold immediately, so I think we probably left the rink and went straight to the store and bought equipment. <laughs> Watching her play kind of got the bug for me to play, and then uh, I started playing and we played on a team together. It's just a bunch of guys and gals that are generally in their middle ages out there playing hockey, living a little bit of glory, so it, it's fun. It's something we all, we all know and we all have like a specific passion for, I guess. Like it's, you can... We can talk about it. We can relate to each other about it. We, we, there's like a whole different language for it. I mean, it's there's so many things we share with it, and just the passion for the game is mutual around the whole family. I mean, everyone plays and everyone loves it. So I kind of started a little later than Victor. I started in fourth grade, wasn't it? I think it was fourth grade. Yeah. And um, I've been playing ever since. I haven't stopped. It's been really fun. Even though I can't like do all the things like ski club and stuff, it's always been fun. Sometimes it's overwhelming because you're just never ever leaving the rink. It's practice after practice versus you're just constantly freezing and cold and at the rink. <laughs> but it's worth it in the end because it keeps us all together and talking about the same thing and growing as a family together. I can't remember not playing it. Like I don't remember a time where like I didn't play it. I don't remember a time where it wasn't like influence in my life and stuff like that so it's always been a huge part of my life and we all enjoy it we like to watch it we like to play it we like to talk about it as a family that's really what it is is what uh, an opportunity for us it's something we all bond through we can all talk about and enjoy and uh grow together with it